Northwest students will find themselves wrapped in history and tradition during their time in Maryville, but for those students living on campus, they'll find that their homes away from home bear the names of several people that have impacted the school for over 100 years. The newly built Perrin and Hudson residence halls are named for two pioneers in Northwest history, Alice Perrin, the first dean of women, and Nell Hudson, the first female registrar. Campus high-rises that were built in the 60s and 70s are named for prominent figures in the education department. Phillips Hall is named for Homer T. Phillips, former department chair, and Franken and Milliken Halls are named for Chloe Milliken and Katherine Franken, education professors. Dietrich Hall is named for former Horace Mann principal Herbert Dietrich. He was the only one of the four alive to see his name honored. Tower Suites is named after Tower Hall, a former residential building that once stood between the North and South Complex. A portion of Tower Hall can still be seen today above the North Complex. Residential Life Director Matt Baker said that a room still occupies the piece, but it hasn't been used in years. Finally, there's Roberta Hall, the oldest residence building on campus. The building is home to Northwest Sororities and is named after Roberta Steele, a former student who died following an explosion near the building in 1950. Since her death, legend has it that Roberta's spirit haunts the building. She is reportedly seen from time to time, but her presence is known more through odd occurrences. Reporting for the Northwest Missourian and NWMissouriNews.com, I'm Dominic Gennetti.